A journey is best measured in friends rather than miles, and this year we're extending our journey. Join us as we comb the beaches of Lake Superior and explore Michigan's Upper Peninsula. Hey, what's up everybody? We are in the Upper Peninsula, and we are hitting the Bill Nichols Trail. We're gonna go over some trestle bridges, hopefully find a ghost mine or abandoned mine. So, stick around, should be fun. So, so far the Bill Nichols Trail is pretty flat. It's not much of a uh, off-road, it's more of like a gravel road. But beautiful scenery, trestle bridges were cool. So take a look. This is pretty much what the Bill Nichols Trail, I think the seven hour plane crash, it mixes together. There it is. It's like a flat dirt road. So. We're going slow to keep the dust down. Ooh, creepy. I'll stay out here and stand watch. Just in case they don't come back. If I hear screams, I may start driving. All right, I lied. I gotta see the creep. I gotta see the creepy cabin. I didn't hear anybody screaming, so figured it was safe. <laughs> Do I ignore the sign that says "keep out"? Yeah. All right, sneaking into the creepy cabin. Kind of cool. Guessing that's where the bodies go. Down in that hole. It's very zombie-like.
SWAT team ride. Oh shit. <laughs> While most of us trolls reside under the Mackinac Bridge, Benny the Beard is a wooden troll created by artist Thomas Dembo. And we had to make a stop. Benny the Beard is located in Germfask, Michigan, and he can be found at the Northland Outfitters Campground. It's a great bunch of people. Benny's head, hands, and feet were manufactured in Denmark and then shipped to Germfask. The remainder of his body was assembled on site in July 2023. The cedar planks used to create this fantasy creature were recycled from a nearby Amish lumber mill. He's pretty cool. What's up everybody? We are at Champion Mine. Ghost Mine, Abandoned Mine. But it's kind of cool. So in the sunlight, it's not that scary, but this place would be pretty cool if it was uh, overcast or raining, actually. Thunderstorm. I'd be pretty freaked out if it was a thunderstorm. <laughs> After a couple days of driving on the dusty Bill Nichols Trail, we're going to head to one of the only locations where you can actually drive on the beach. Now, it's called Gay Beach. And it's located in Gay, Michigan. It's named after Joseph Gay, one of the founders of the Mohawk and Wolverine mining companies. All right, we're at Gay Beach. It's kind of a challenge to drive on. I, from all the videos I've seen, it looked like it was fairly easy, but yeah, it has some cushion to it. I had to put Thunderbolt in four-wheel drive because he almost got stuck. So check it out.
So I gotta throw in a little plug for set power. We've been using this uh, PT30 since we got up here, and this thing has been working great. Currently it's sitting in Oscar, and it's been being used as a fridge and a freezer. Let's see if I get into focus. There we go. Thing has been holding strong. See, we got all our breakfast food in there. Nice little roadside lunch at the waterfall. filling our bellies with food, it was time to head north. We were heading to an abandoned town of Clifton, which is south of Phoenix, Michigan. The Cliff Mine was the first successful copper mine in the copper country of Michigan, beginning production in 1845 and remaining the most productive copper mine in the United States until 1854. So, we are on Cliff Drive which you can turn off of it and do the Cliff Mine Trail. It's a very cool trail. Have to go over a small water crossing. That can be a very deep water crossing depending on the season. But we, we just crossed the water. There's a pretty big obstacle at the top of it called the Gatekeeper. And per Onyx, at least the guy that uh, did the trail said that lockers are required so take a look at that
make sure to like and subscribe and stay tuned for next week's video. We're going to end this leg of our trip up in High Rock. See a nether waterfall, fish cove, and some damn dam. Thanks for watching. My name's Shannon. This is Warthog Overland.